Hey guys, it's Preston here. We're back with another game of the New York Yankees franchise. Today we're going to be facing the Red Sox. We are 24 and 12. The Red Sox are 17 and 9, so they're not doing very good so far in the season. But we are. We're um, 12 games above 500, and we got our ace on the mound, Michael Pineda, who will probably be the future of the franchise because he has an under one year A. And I think he's really developing into the pitcher we need in this franchise right now. But he gives up a home run in, in I think it's Jacoby Ellsbury. Yeah, it's his third home run of the season. So not a very good start to play for the for the Yankees. So uh, we're 12 games above 500. Most of the games I've simmed, I've only played like four or five of them. So it's good to know that the team is doing good even when I'm not playing it as it's going to is going to get the first out, so we really need to uh, get an early lead so we have something to build for during the season as Pena is going to strike out the next batter, David Ortiz, and here is Jared Salatamakia, and he's going to get a little dribble to Nunez, the off-balance throw will be in time. So other than that home run, Pena works a Gets the three outs after that, and Gardner's gonna lead off for us, and he's going to get a ground out to the shortstop and throw in the first base. And the Arizona lineup: Gardner, Millbrooks, Cano, Trumbo, Teixeira, Reynolds, Vernon Wells, Nunez, and Austin Romine. Brett Gardner was on pr a pretty good hot streak. He's almost batting 300, around 296, eight home runs, a lot of stolen bases. I expect that a lot of them maybe get to around 50 or something. As Miller Brooks is going to fly out to center left field. And here is Cano is going to hit a deep drive ball to left field. But it's going to be at the warning track. And the left fielder will make that. So I'm pretty surprised Boston is struggling this much this far in this season. They've usually been a good team. And I think last year they, they did pretty good. They were in the playoffs and everything. As the Red Sox are going to get hit in the second inning. Now here is Shane Victorino with a 3-0 count. He's going to swing at that pitch. He's going to get a hit into right field. Vernon Wells is going to get that. The runner's going to hold at first and second with two outs. I don't know why he swung at that pitch. I don't know if it's even Shane Victorino. Here is Shane Victorino. And hit. he's going to hit a liner down the left field line. Tremble's going to feel that. He's going to throw to Nunez. One runner will score. And Red, the Boston Red Sox take a 2-0 lead over the Yankees. Now here is Jacoby Ellsbury again, and he's going to hit a dribble or two. Cano is going to throw the second for the easy out. And that ends the inning, but the Red Sox take a 2-0 lead. So let's talk about the real-life Yankees. As of now, they're tied 1-1 against the Rays. If they lose this game, their season is pretty much over as Trumbo's going to get a first hit. And if you're going to tell already, I'm pretty much a Yankee fan. That's why I do a franchise and all this kind of stuff. So it would be disappointing if they missed the postseason for like the first time in like 2008 and then before that, I don't know when. So I'm not used to them losing this much, but they had a lot of injuries early in the season and they kind of caught up, but then they kept losing more games and it's just a big mess season. Reynolds is going to avoid the double play. Reynolds on first and third with one out and Reynolds is going to steal second because they won't throw over. Got to take advantage of everything we have. Because I'm playing like Legend of Difficulty or something like that. And the ball gets past the catcher. Trumbo, he's running to home. It will be very, not very close play. Trumbo couldn't make it home for some reason. He should have been hustling. I don't know if he was. Well, Vernon Wells is going to get a hit into left field. That's all taken care of though. But we do get on the board. We're now losing 2-1. to one, So not as bad before. Nunez up. Wells is going to get picked off. Don't even know how that's possible. He has like a one step lead. But we do make some progress getting a, getting a run. And here is Pineda pitching to Zach Underwood. Their prospect are really much rookie. Gardner's going to be going all the way to the track at the wall. And he's going to dive and hit the wall. Should be dead. Because I don't know if he should even survive an injury like that. He went head first into the wall. Which isn't very soft at all. Just there. And... Gardner should be dead. That's all I should say. Miller Brooks is going to hit a deep fly ball into the gap of center right field. Miller Brooks is going to get an easy double. He's, he's, his, 
season's been doing pretty good since he had a good one last year. Cano's going to drive that into deep center right field. It's going to bounce off the wall. Cano, he's running first. He's going to second base. The throw will not be in time. Cano's diving in there. And Cano ties it up 2-2. Two -two. Trombo up again. The pitch. It's going to be a deep drive to center field. Ellsbury's at the track. He's at the wall. And that will be gone. Trombo's 8th home run of the season. Gets a nice couple of RBIs, couple of hormones. Adds to his total, and he breaks the tie. We are now the Yankees are now winning 4-2. Mark Reynolds up with a 3-0 count. The pitch will be a taking ball four, and we get another nice runner on first. Nunez up, pitch. It's going to be a fly ball into right field. Nothing much there, and it's pretty much an out. But Yankees do take a 4-2 lead over the Red Sox, so. They're the rivals. They really need to win these couple games for the division. Still doing good in the, the Yankees are still doing good though. 24 and 12 record, so they're not doing too bad. In theory, their lineup should be worse than last year, but their but the replacements from last year are doing pretty good. Gardner's gonna hit that down the right field line. It's gonna go not almost yeah. It's gonna go around the wall. Gardner's gonna go into second base, sliding with his speed. And now we got runner in scoring position. Now we got Middlebrooks up. He's on a hot streak, but they're going to walk him. I don't know why they would rather face Cano than Middlebrooks, but whatever they say. Cano's going to be up in the first pitch. He's going to drive that into right field for a base. Gardner's running third. He's coming home. Middlebrooks is... Well, Gardner's safe, and Middlebrooks gets a third. Cano moves over the second base, stealing. And Trimbo's going to hit deep fly ball to center field just around the warning track. Millerbrooks is going to tag up and score, and Cano's going to move to third base. And they're going to, Red Sox are going to take out Dempster and put another guy, I don't know, I'll pronounce his name. The share is going to be up, it's going to be a grounder to Dustin Pedroia, and he will make the easy toss over. And the Yankees have taken a very good lead, 6-2. So, they've really had the run productions there so far, unlike in Detroit, and a lot, or, yeah, Detroit has... Trombo's going to make a nice catch. He's not much for his defense, but I'll take it any day. Salto Machia up the pitch. It's going to be a grounder too. Nunez is going to bobble it a bit, but the throw will be in time. Nunez recovered easily and gets a nice help. Pineda has been pretty much dominating the Red Sox. Retiring, I don't even know how much by now. Maybe like 15 or something like that. Gardner's going to make another diving catch. So this is a pretty good defensively game. You might as well say. Pineda's retired, I don't know, lost like 15 batters, so they're really not hitting against Pineda. Two outs in the eighth inning, 0 2 count, and it's going to be a strikeout. That's pretty much what's been the whole day ever since those two runs. Pineda really hasn't given up anything, really. So, nice performance by him. Cano's going to be up first, but he's going to drive that into left field, and it will be gone. He knows he has one of the season, and he extends the lead to 7-2. Might as well just give up right the Red Sox because it's over, basically. Kano has a chance for MVP season. He's hitting above 350 at this time right now as Trump is going to line out. He has a lot of home runs, so we might have a couple of MVP candidates, some all-stars. It's a good season for the Yankees. They really need this after losing the postseason, see if they can win the World Series. But... To share strikes out. That's just great. Shares on the decline. Might need a trade number somewhere. Might need some. Might need some a better outfielder because we don't have that much other than Gardner, but Trumbo. But we really need those two extra depth that outfielders. As Brown is going to strike out. Cano extending the lead. He really hit that ball well. It was low in the way, and he just hit that the opposite way. Good thing for Cano. We go to the bottom of the or top of the ninth inning, and here is Dustin Pedroia up on one count. The pitch he's going to hit that into center field for a base hit. It's going to be one of the few hits Pineda's giving up this whole entire day, and um, he's still going to Pineda's going to st still be in the game because it's not really that much of a lead they have, chance they have winning. David Ortiz up one two count. The pitch it's going to be a grounder two. Cano is going to flip for Nunez onto one two to Scherer for the double play. David Ortiz is not very fast, so he's pretty much given double play. And now Red Sox are the Red Sox are down to their last. 
nice play by the Yankees. Really showing their talent. They're they're much, they're turning into a more of a younger team. All, all these different players, training the veterans and everyone else for good players. Salto Maki up one two count the pitch, and it's gonna be taking strike three call. Amazing game by Pineda and it's a pretty good game. So, so subscribe, like, comment, and my name is Preston. I'll see you guys later next year.